Hello everyone! What a beautiful day today! And today, I decided to finally get a membership at Costco to find out what all the fuss is all about and see if my membership worth it. But before that, I browsed the internet how to get a good deal on Costco membership. And luckily, for a new member like me, there is an offer of $50 voucher towards $150 online purchase. So Costco emailed me a code and the instruction on how to redeem the $50 voucher towards my $150 online purchase. So if I use that voucher on my future online purchase that would pay off some of my annual membership and it will leave me a $10 membership for a year it's a good deal to start most of us wants to save money on our groceries and other purchases our friends and even family members believe that the best way to do so is by joining the warehouse club like Costco. I am not a member, but since I received this $50 Costco voucher towards my online purchase of $150, that would pay off some of my membership. Though there are some nice benefits of having a Costco membership, I still believe I need to weigh the pros and cons first before committing myself into it. Getting a Costco membership is not a one size fits all. So today I decided to shop and get myself my first membership for the very first time and to see and prove it if my membership really worth it. To shop at Costco first, you have to be a member. Costco has two personal membership. The Gold Star membership costs $60 annually. And the second one, the Executive Gold Star membership that costs $120 annually. The Gold Star allows you to shop online and shop at any Costco worldwide and also includes another card for your spouse or a family member which is 18 years old or above at the same address. The second membership is the Executive Gold Star membership which costs $120 annually. With this you can get same benefit as the gold star membership plus it offers you a two percent reward up to a thousand dollars in a year for your qualified purchases so to cover the 60 dollar difference from the basic membership you have to spend three thousand dollars annually or 250 dollars monthly but not every single purchase is eligible. So your purchases towards your gasoline, alcohol, eye exams, tobacco, and even your purchases towards gift certificates, these are not eligible. One more thing that I consider in getting a membership today is that the distance of my travel is only 7 to 10 minutes away from home and this depends upon the traffic. We're almost there.
so let's go shop with me and at the end of my video I give you my opinion so if you're coming here every Fridays or Saturday on Sunday usually parking is full so the trick is to come early or if you have the time to shop during weekdays like Tuesday Wednesday and Thursday around 1 o'clock to 4 o'clock that's the best time to shop it's not crowded and you have a huge selection of parking we're here this is a very good parking spot not too far it's good for a little walk so here we go long. long line up and people with low levels of patience but they might feel like it's tough to avoid a lot of waiting and Costco can be extremely crowded place even with pandemic restrictions and anyone who hates these big crowds and the long lineup I guess they should skip the trip this is the lineup outside the Costco warehouse and there's more lined up inside the Costco We all have different reasons why we go to Costco. The big reason is savings. Some is a little getaway or a stress reliever. But for some, it's overwhelming. Finally, we reached the entrance. And there is another line up inside. To shop at Costco, you must have the time and patience for the long lineup. So first, let's go to the customer service to apply for our membership. They need a piece of ID and a payment of $60 for your Gold Star membership and they take a picture of you and right away you will get your membership card and now you can start shopping So the first thing you can see 
is the electronic department. Here's the TVs. And beside it, there's also the optical where you can have your eyeglasses, sunglasses, or the prescription glasses. Jewelry and watches area is near electronics and to buy anything from jewelry you have to take a merchandise slip to the checkout counter because there is no dedicated person at this section. IELTS doesn't have signs identifying what's on that aisle, so you have to walk past the huge, long, towering aisles and look as best as you can to find what you are looking for. So here's the huge selection of chocolates and candies and snack bars. Here's a selection of towels, hand towels, very good quality. Also have pillows, comforters. At the middle of the store, they have the clothing area for whole family. Costco selection of shirts and ladies underwear have great discounts and excellent quality as well and even the Costco Kirkland underwear for men it was reviewed as extremely comfortable and last two to three times longer than Hanes and other brands and if you need clothes to wear to your yoga class Check out the bargains at Costco. They have unbeatable bargain for leggings. So the farther you walk into the store, the better the deals you will find. If you notice, the best selling item, toilet paper, is at the back of the store and that way it gets all the customers from the front of the store to the back if possible you should avoid the front because that usually has the highest markups so the farther you go at the center of the store you will see the seasonal promotions Costco carries huge selection of quality products so if you are prone to impulse buying Costco can cost you to overspending 
so you have to plan ahead. Buy only the best deals and buy what you need. Know the good deal from Just OK Deal because some things are cheaper at Costco but it doesn't mean everything. You must also consider the shelf life of a product and check the expiration dates if you are buying perishable goods in bulk that can lead to huge amount of food waste on top of wasting your money. Most of these baked goods are made at the store and it's hard to miss the huge oven and racks of newly baked breads at the bakery section. This section smells like freshly made cookies and the smell is a great way to entice shoppers into buying breads, pastries, muffins and it is in enormous size. I've heard great reviews of Costco cakes. They look lovely and delicious. And you can special order them with flavors and decorations of your choice. But there are ready to go choices as well. Costco also have the best deals on beef, pork, and even chicken. One of the busiest spots in the store was the chicken rotisserie counter. Their whole chicken are cooked all day long in a big ovens, leaving them tender and juicy. And they are packed and kept hot until you take them home. Here's the Costco's famous toilet paper, the Kirkland brand. There's also a huge selection of quality cheeses and they are way cheaper than other stores. As 
waffles are only $4.99 compared to other stores. This is way cheaper. The Sunlight Dishwashing Liquid at 4.4 liters is only $9.99 at Costco, while at Canadian Tire is $11.99 for 4.2 liters only. And at Walmart is $9.97, also 4.2 liters. Chips are way cheaper and they are in the large package compared to other stores. Here's a huge selection of ice creams and frozen treats and they are way cheaper than other stores. I suggest that before you shop at Costco, you have to set your grocery budget. This is crucial. There are just too many good things at Costco that you will definitely overspend. Costco can be magical dreamland when it comes to deals, only if you know what to buy. Although buying in bulk at store like Costco does save you money, there are still many tricks to learn that will make you save more. Here are some few tips from a friend of mine 
who is a previous Costco employee. First, if you buy an item before it goes on sale, you can ask for a price match and you can go back to the Costco within 30 days and get a price adjustment. Secondly, buy store brand products, which is the Kirkland. It is known for creating high quality product and it's a Costco label and it will save you more money. Third, shop seasonal products at the end of season like winter coats, chocolates, Christmas decors, and so much more. Fourth, try shopping online. It shows you the great deals to take advantage of. Fifth, learn their price code. If there is asterisk in a price tag, the item will not be restocking again, and this is a seasonal item. Number six, if the price ends in 0.97 or 97 cents, it means the item is on clearance. It won't go lower than that. You have to buy it because this is the best price that you will find. Seven, if the price ends in zero, zero or 88 cents, this is a manager's markdown. But be sure to check the items Sometimes they might be returned or damaged. Some items are really cheaper compared to other stores. Like this package of corn, 12 pieces, it cost $11.99. That would make it a dollar each compared to Walmart regular price for the price of corn of one can is a dollar seventy four so for one package of 12 cans of corn i already saved 74 cents each multiplied by 12 pieces that gives me eight dollars 88 cents in savings Another item that is really cheaper compared to other stores that I found is the head and shoulders. This one at Costco for two pieces cost $17.99. So for one piece is $9 for 950 ml. Compared to the price of Head and Shoulders Shampoo at Walmart for 950 ml, it costs $10.96, which is already on sale. And that gives me a $4 savings for my two package of shampoo. And sometimes even Costco have on sale prices as well, and that lowers more and gives me more savings on my purchase. This 
Easter C vitamin C at uh, 1000 milligram and 180 tablets cost 18.99 at Costco while at Walmart Easter C vitamin C 1000 milligram as well at 60 tablets it costs $14.99 that's a huge difference in the price it's almost $30 in savings and sometimes we got even more savings at Costco they do have sales as well like this one now from $18.99 it went down to $14.99 and if you purchase this product about uh, 30 days ago you can still have the price match and they will give you the difference and if you are using this glaxal base moisturizer like i do the price at costco for 450 grams plus the additional 50 grams for the small tube only cost $16.99 while at Walmart for only 250 grams it cost $17.97 this is another very good deal huge savings The Avino lotion at Costco costs $17.99 for 3 pack of 532 ml. So if you divide the price by 3, it would cost $6 per piece. While at Walmart, for the Avino lotion at 532 ml, it costs $11.27. That's a savings of $5.27 for each piece. Another good deal that I found was the Colgate Total Whitening. At Costco, it cost $9.99 for five pieces in a pack of 170 ml if you divide that by five pieces each would cost only two dollars while at walmart the 170 ml of colgate total whitening costs three dollars 97 cents and it's already on sale price that's a difference of $1.97 each piece. So when you compare prices, it becomes evident that you are often ahead. The savings that come from Costco membership can be significant provided you stick to your list. And of course, this is often easier said than done. There are lots of many tempting items on the store and members often end up spending extra by impulse buying. Before heading out of the store, try to stop by at the cafe which is always busy but food is good and inexpensive. I guess the most popular item on the cafe is the hot dog combo for only $1.50 and you get a huge hot dog and a soda with free refills. And also hold on to your receipt before you head out because Costco checks your receipts before you leave. Employees make a quick item count on your purchases but this is still a bit of a hassle if there is a lineup 
and also if you are in a hurry. So my conclusion is, with my purchases today, this is enough to justify the cost of my membership for the entire year. So whether you should get a membership, this depends on your shopping habits and lifestyles. If you have large family and space for storing your extra groceries, buying in bulk can save time and money. And for large families, the executive membership may be the best option because of its 2% cashback reward program. And for single or couple, Costco membership may be less useful, especially if you have a small storage at home or a space. But you can also try sharing membership with a friend. Hope you guys enjoy coming along. I really enjoy shopping at Costco. And please let me know your opinion. Just make sure you make your comments below. Thank you for watching and see you guys for my next video. Bye for now. Stay safe. And if you are new to my vlog, please don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you. Bye for now.